I bet that you guys are excited for a DLC or for a new game. For me, I'm, I'm excited for the apocalypse. Gonna be a great time. So welcome everyone, my name is Phantom, and today we are looking at the 8 things that we know is gonna happen in the future of COD Zombies that we're hyped for, right, that we're looking forward to. That's not gonna be a, a good YouTube title, so it'll probably be something clickbaity, but yeah, we're looking at Infinite Warfare, World War 2, the, the video game, and Treyarch's next game, so we're looking to the future, and all this stuff's gonna happen in like the next year, so it, it's pretty good. Okay, so the first thing that we can look forward to is Infinite Warfare DLC 4, let's... Let's pretend this hasn't come out already, and it'll be much better. So, The Beast From Beyond. Pretty damn good. Can't believe it's DLC 4 of Infinite Warfare already. This game's already over. So, the map, in, it sort of mixes zombies and extinction in a blender. That doesn't actually sound very good on the outside, but it's pretty cool. Let's just hope that the Gaming Revolution's questions can be answered, okay? That's that's how you end the game. You need, these questions need to be answered, alright? So yeah lads, enjoy DLC 4 of Infinite Warfare, the last DLC, and unless we pull some sort of DLC 5 Extinction remake on our asses, I don't know, I don't know. But now, number 7, if we're counting backwards, is more World War 2, I don't know how to put it, like, information, because COD World War 2 is sort of in a, in a, I don't know, a stalemate, is, is that the word? We're waiting for more, you know, maybe we'll get a live stream where they talk about it, maybe we'll get the intro cutscene. Hopefully we don't just get more images of zombie parts on Twitter, because that's not very hype anymore, you know, I don't want to see a zombie's arm, alright? Stop with that stuff. But honestly, we can get hyped for more COD World War 2 zombies, like, teasers and info that they're going to put out, uh, hopefully they put out at some time, because we need more. And then number six is World at War's birthday, alright, so next year, when Treyarch's next game comes out, World at War, the first game to have zombies, is going to be ten years old. I wouldn't really say it's a birthday, because because games aren't, like, birthed, you know, they're, they're made, but, you know, so they're going to celebrate it somehow. Maybe remastered maps or something, maybe we'll have a map, maybe we'll go for a meal, right? Maybe there'll be a map and we go out, celebrate the birthday. Wait, that's already a thing. Um, oh wait, that, that's already another thing. What, what, stop this, why is this a thing? But yeah, there has to be some sort of celebration for World at War for zombies turning 10 years old. And now another thing that we can look forward to is, remember that mode from Black Ops 2 turn that was really good? Well, really damn bad at the same time. Well, now it's in Black Ops 3, but okay, no clickbait, it's in there as a mod, alright? So you can only play this if you have PC. Some YouTubers have been playing it this week, so you might have seen it. And, like I said, like not everyone's interested in PC mods because they don't have it, but it's still so cool to see that people can add completely new game modes into Black Ops 3 Zombies. But we could get anything we wanted. Maybe I can play zombies as a carrot. That'd be awesome. I don't even know what number we're on anymore, but another thing that we can look forward to is the Super Easter Egg in Infinite Warfare Zombies. My boy, Lee Ross, he's coming back. He's going to hit us with something better than an RK5 when you spawn in. So there's going to be a real Super Easter Egg cross map Easter Egg. It's going to add new cutscenes, going to change the other maps, a new boss fight. It's, it's gonna, it sounds awesome, okay? We'll have to wait and see how it actually turns out, because it could be tragic, you know? It, it could be bad, because it's not like they're going to say, oh yeah, we have a new super easter egg, but it's really bad, like, it's terrible. You know, they're going to obviously say that it's really good and big, so we're just going to have to wait and see until it's actually found out and see, see what it does. But if it is good, then that's pretty cool, so I'm looking forward to seeing how that goes. And even if you're not into Infinite Warfare Zombies, like, seeing the super easter egg is pretty cool, because easter egg hunts in zombies are one of the best things. One of the best things. And now, this is a big one, I think this is number 2 on the list, I'm not sure, but it's the launch of Call of Duty World War 2. Like, you know, it's been hype building up, but when this game finally comes out in only 2 months time, we can get hands on, you know, we can we can flamethrower people, we can we can get chased by dead people, it's, it's amazing, it's an amazing time, amazing time. So, we can finally see if this game is, like, worth all the hype, because it is hype right now, so we can see if... The Zombies community is going to love this game, hopefully they do, so we can all surround this one game. Because, you know, this year it's been split, people not playing Zombies at all, people playing Black Ops 3, or people playing IW, you know. Finally, we'll all be one, if the game's good, right? If, it, if it's tragedy, then, uh, then it's back to Minecraft, lads, back to Minecraft, alright? I cannot wait until COD World War 2 is released and we can finally play it, but number one, 
we are looking forward to the reveal of Treyarch's next game, and it's going to blow your mind when I say that they're going to probably reveal this game in only six months. Okay, that, that does actually sound pretty long, but you know what I'm saying, so we're going to finally see if all the Mob of the Dead and London hints are true, we'll, we'll see what the like, actual game, like the campaign and multiplayer are set. It's going to be amazing, you know, Treyarch is always hype, we have so much faith in them. Let's let's just hope that reveal doesn't have something like this, you know, like that bad ruin it. Like, what is that? Like, where's that little creature there? Like, we wouldn't want zombies to be like that. So, it's gonna be very interesting. So, if anyone is still even here, tell me which thing on this list you are most looking forward to. So, there's like eight big things that I could think of in my mind. I probably forgot something quite big. The eight big things that's gonna happen in like the next year or so. Big things in the zombies community. Let's hope. That the community doesn't die. Let's hope that dinosaurs don't come back, want to take the planet back like they originally had it. And Because if that happens, we'll, we'll never get to play these. But, like, it's going to be interesting. The, the past, like, year or so of zombies have been pretty rough, apart from Zombies Chronicles. So, hopefully it gets better, right? Hopefully it gets better. So, stay spicy, my friends. I'll see you in the next one. If, if there's ever a next one. Ho hopefully there's a next one.